Jason Witten announces that he's coming out of retirement. Um, she's, I mean, I, I really don't know uh, what I think about this. Um, kind of, you know, I, I kind of think about myself. I kind of think about, you know, Brett Favre, right? And um, what I see with Brett Favre, it, you know, kind of, is he past his prime? Yes. It's kind of, it's almost like he's refusing to maybe, like, uh, accept, um, you know, that he's past his prime and just uh, be retired. I don't know if this is, I don't know if I'm willing to make that statement that this is going to um, hurt his legacy or not. Um, not sure if I want to make that type of a statement uh, with produced production. You know, like when I think of a guy like you know, Brett Favre, you know, I'm going to retire, I'm not going to retire, I'm retiring, not retiring. And that kind of became Brett Favre's legacy in the end. Um, I just don't know... Uh, if it's worth it for uh, for Witten to do this, and I and I get that um, you know and I get that you know people just forget that you know these are regular people and I think the money and the fun of playing the game is worth maybe they think that it's worth maybe uh, you know a little off the top of it, of their legacy. Maybe they even maybe they didn't even look at look at it that way. I mean, to me you just go out on top and really what more do you have to prove at this age of 37? Yes, he was away from the game from a year, so his aches and pains maybe healed up, but not completely. Uh, you know, uh, and it's still a fast game. Can he play like he used to even even before he retired his play significantly declined uh, it hasn't gotten any better um, now I could see this um, I could see this coming where he's mentoring that team the players on that team You know, can he break tackles anymore? I don't think so. He's slow, and I don't really think he has anything to do with the quarterback. Maybe he was always slow. I know he was always slow, but now even slower. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Point to him for Witten is the fact that he almost never dropped the ball. He's probably the best blocking tight end in the league. I can guarantee that that will be the same as far as blocking uh, when he does return. That I could definitely tell you. You know, great hands too. Tell you that about Witten. His health never got injured, but he do have some a 